Hey, 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 it's time to film a YouTube paycheck stuffing. And yesterday I did my nails. I did Jamberry. Have you ever heard of Jamberry? I used to sell these back in the day. So these are so old, like, oh my God, I don't even know. Maybe close to 10 years old. I don't know, but um, I did my nails and they look nice and whatever, but look, I already lost both pinkies and I have no idea how that happens happened because I put gel over the top of them so they would last longer and yeah, hi. <laughs> so, hi, what is up? We're gonna do a fun little stuffing today and guess what? It's all thanks to you guys. So, thank you so much. This is my YouTube paycheck for the month of April you get paid a month behind. Um, today is May 21st and I have not gotten the paycheck yet. However, it usually comes the 21st or 22nd. So I figured I would go ahead and stuff it. Um, and yeah, I am super excited to do some challenges, make some progress on my goals and yes. So a humongous thank you to you all, no matter what way you support me, I am grateful for it all. Um, Yes, I I could not do this stuffing without you. So just thank you so, so much. Let me show you the money. So for this paycheck, it was $219. So we're going to put $19 in taxes and then $100 in each of Christmas and vacay. Now, let me tell you something. $19 is not a lot. It's nowhere near 20% or anything like that. However, I am really, really far ahead in saving for taxes. I already have the next payment um, saved up, which is due next month. And then we're working on September and I only have two more. Um, so I decided to, you know, stuff a little bit less into taxes while I have, you know, some bigger goals to meet. So we're going to do $19. I also um, am putting in a little bit from a prior Etsy payout, this past Etsy payout. Um, but I'm not going to do that on camera. I'm just going to do that, you know, um, by myself. Uh, it's only a little bit, but every little bit helps, of course. Um, so yeah, let me go ahead and add 19. I'm going to add it to my tracker here. Okay, so that is this 20 right here. So um, I'm going to add a 20 and I was hoping I had a one and I do. So I'm going to take this $1 out and we now have 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 400. So 1,400, 20, 40, 60. Perfect. So 1,460, 800 of that will come out um, next month when you know, I have to pay the next quarterly taxes and I need to make sure to remember to do that before I go on the cruise. It is, you know, due June 15th. So that is done. Yes. And I can't, you know, I couldn't color in anything else on my tracker, but that's fine. All right. So let's get down to the fun stuff. So we are doing $100 in vacation and it's just a hundred dollar bill because it's all going in the same envelope. So let's grab that and... This is a sneak peek of something, you guys. Um, I am coming out with my own magnetic bookmarks. So if you've seen Salisa over at Beautifully Me and You, um, I decided I wanted to create some of these for myself. And then I thought, well, I might as well put them up in the Etsy shop. So if you were on my live this past weekend, you would have already seen these. But this is my IOU. There will be more styles of IOUs, but you know I love the rainbows. And yeah, it's, you know, a magnetic bookmark and it clips right onto your envelopes. And um, there's not just going to be IOUs. There will be fully funded. There will be regular ones and all the things. So if you see these floating around now, you know um, that these are going to be available in my shop. They're not currently up yet. I'm not sure when they will be up because I'm working on more styles. But um, that is a sneak peek. So all that to say, <laughs> I have um, a $5 IOU because as Tony Leland so nicely pointed out to me, which thank you so much, I colored in $5 extra on one of these trackers than I should have. So um, let's, um, okay, let's do this. 
I have $100 and let's subtract the five right now. So I have 95 to work with. Let me go ahead and grab some markers really quick. Let's get some of this stuff out of the way so we could see what we're working with here. Um, I, oh, I'm so excited to like have a bulk of this done already. As you know, these are being saved for my vacation, which is coming up next month. So I need to get them done. Um, let's see what we want to do today. Let's knock out the rest of these 15s, I think. So that's 15, 30, and 45. And by the way, these two challenges are from uh, Lisa Grateful Me over at the Happy Mailbox Co. And I think let's go ahead and see how much of this we can knock out. And then maybe next time we'll finish this one. We'll see. So I have $50 left to work with. So we have 10, 20, 30, 45, 50, 5, and 50. So it looks like we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, about 55 left to go. So that was a super quick way <laughs> to spend 100 bucks, but we are making such good progress. We have all the 15s done on these two challenges, and yes. Um, I, my goal, let's see, where did I even write that? I think it's actually still here on my other Taco Tuesday binder. Uh, my goal is eleven seventy. I'm actually adding about two hundred and I think it's two eighty more to this goal. I don't know if I will get to my entire goal, which is fine. But um, we booked an excursion, and I didn't want to pay for it. So I said, if you want to do this excursion to my husband, I said you have to pay for it. So what he said was, you just pay for it and take it off of what. You owe me. So that debt that I owe him, I took 200, I think it was 282. I took that off the debt and I'm going to pay for it, but I'm adding that to my goal because that's not figured in. So um, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 50, 65, 75, 85, 285, I think that was. So perfect. And I think what I'm going to do instead of transferring this money to savings is I might go just take it out of the ATM and start replacing the prop money because we're going in a month and I need cash. So I'm going to probably use cash for basically everything to pay for the dog, of course, my spending money, you know, gas money, parking. I don't know if they accept cash, so I might have to do that on credit. But yeah, I think I'm going to start replacing the prop money with real cash. I don't want to have to take a, a lot out of my savings. So instead of transferring money to my savings and then taking it out, this way I could just take out the cash and replace the prop money. It's basically the same thing. All right, so that is it. And then last but not least, we have $100 for Christmas. Yes, I am, let me tell you, so, so behind on stuffing for Christmas. I wanted to put about $200 a month in this binder and I have not been just because I've been really trying to save for vacation. Um, so yeah, I just, I need to start <laughs> really going harder on this. Um, I did put a little in, I think this past paycheck, which was nice, but yeah, I need to kind of bulk it up majorly. So I am going to actually put this envelope in the back. So this is my Liz and Lesh challenge, but um, I decided because it has amounts on it, I want to do that towards the end so that, you know, we take care of the unknowns first, like the scratch offs, and then I can decide what to put in these last two. Hopefully that makes sense. All right, so as I said, we have $100. 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 100. And by the way, if you were on my live on Saturday and you won a giveaway, um, they have all been sent out except for the magnetic bookmarks that Marsha won. I'm still working on those. 
Um, and then if you are a new member that joined on my live, your savings challenges uh, went out yesterday, your free challenges. So um, I wanted to mention that, mention that in the prior video and I forgot. So there you go. Okay, so challenge number one. This one here is from Janelle over at Janelle Ray Budgets. It's this these Grinch scratch-offs. I'm working on the Grinch first. And let's go ahead and see what we have right here. Ooh, a 10. Okay. I absolutely cannot wait to start finishing some of these. Um, I don't think I'm really that close on any of them. But yesterday I watched Liz's video and she finished one of her Christmas challenges. And that's just so exciting. So 10, 15, 25, 27, 29, 31, 33, 30. <laughs> five 36 37 37 dollars i think and no idea how much these add up to but that is fine i'm feeling like maybe i should do a little condensing of this binder and i might do a cash condensing just because i don't have a video for this weekend i don't have anything planned or any money really to <laughs> do anything so i might do a condensing we will see Okay, this one I believe is from Ren over at Mischief Managed Budgets. So let's go here. Ugh, another 10. I figured that one would be big. Um, this one I think is a super OG. She doesn't even have her name on it. That's why I'm not positive it's from her. It might be from Janelle, but I think it's from Ren. All right, so we're adding another 10 in here. And this is a $100 challenge, so 20, 30, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. So we are exactly halfway. However, this one has a bonus, so I, I'm guessing this is not included in the $100. I don't know. We will see. Um, I guess what I'm going to do is just try to go through the binder. I could potentially come back if I have extra money, but I know I have big numbers at the end that I could just fill in, so that's probably what we will do. Okay, this one is also from Ren over at Mischief Manage Budgets, and it's another double digit. Wow, it's another 10. You guys, should I play the lottery or something? <laughs> that's three tens in a row. Really, really weird. Okay, so another 10 going in. Let me actually put in this 20 and take out a 10. So we have 20, 30, 45, 46, 47, and this is also a $100 challenge. So we're just about halfway on that one. Um, these envelopes, somebody had asked me about these last video. Um, I just made these myself. Uh, this was a pack of Christmas paper that I got on Amazon with all these different designs and I just put them together and laminated them. So just in case you're curious about that, it's cool because it's double sided. So you have, you know, the print on the inside also. All right. Another one from Ren. <laughs> she is like the queen of my Christmas binder. This is a $75 one. Let's finish off this side over here. We have six. And let's actually go ahead and do another one on this because I'm sort of getting close to finishing this one. And four. Perfect. And look at that. Another ten. Wow. <laughs> all right. So there goes all my tens pretty much. So 10, 20, 30, 5, 40, 42, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. So 50 dollars, and as I said, it's 75. So we have 25 left on that one. Um, in case you are curious, this ring is my ultra human ring. I just got it yesterday. It's a smart ring. It's basically sort of like you know a smartwatch, but it's a ring. Um I'm liking it so far, but you know, I've only been wearing it less than 24 hours. So we'll see. All right, this is Christmas Friends. This is from Marlene over at Snow Gardener 307. Let's go right here. You guys, what is happening right now? Do you see this? It's another 10. <laughs> 
something really strange <laughs> is happening. I really feel like I need to play the lottery. This is nuts. <laughs> All right, so another 10 it is. I think I've gotten 10 in literally every single challenge. All right, there goes the last 10. So we have 10, 20, 5, 26, and 27 in this one. And it is a mystery amount, so I'm not sure how much that one will be. Okay, next is also from Marlene. This is Christmas in July. And this one is a lower income one, so I know I'm not going to get a 10 on this one. These are just ones, twos, although there is one 10. Georgette is $10. So can I find Georgette and get a 10? That would be nuts. Let's go in the corner. For a second there, I thought it was her because <laughs> it's pink. But no, this is an ornament, which is $2. So that's two. Let's go here. Another ornament. So that's four. Let's go here. Another ornament for six. Let's just keep on going. And a beach ball for one. So that's seven. I love how low this one is because you can do a lot at once. So that's seven. Is this Georgette? I think I found her, you guys. I did. So that's 10. So that's 17 for this one. Okay, so we found Georgette. I don't know if there's more than one Georgette, but I'm, I'm guessing there's not. So 17, and we're making really good progress with this one. 5, 10, 15, 16, and 17. Okay, so we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 22, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. And even $30 in there. And this one's going to be pretty low, but that is okay. All right, looks like we're getting towards the end, you guys. So this is Plan to Plan Sticker Co. This one I'm using for Black Friday. Um, this is like not necessary. This is just kind of extra nice to have savings. I don't know if I'll get to this entire goal. We'll see. But each of these little bag stickers is worth $10. And I'm just going to do the one. So we will clip this back on here. And five and 10 going in. All right, so I was interrupted. <laughs> but in here, we now have 25, 30, 32, 33, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 50. <laughs> 50 bucks in here. Alrighty. We're getting down to the money. And we didn't even get to the big boys yet. So I think I probably went a little too heavy on some others. It's fine. It's all going to Christmas. All right. This is Christmas in July from Budget with Mama Bear. It is actually a double-sided. This back side is 100 and this side is 50. So we're working on the $50 side first. Let's go here. It looks like it's a 7 All right, so we got five, six, and seven going in. And so now in here we have five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 32, 33, 4, 5, 6, 36 out of the 50. So we're getting close to finishing the first side of that. Okay, so next is for sure. And then we just have basically our 25 envelope challenge. So let's see what we have left here. 5, 10... 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So let's see if there's a six on here and a 10 on here. Okay, there is a 10. Let's see if we have a six. We do, perfect. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this little guy here for $6. 
This is from Liz and Les, if I didn't already say it. It's for sure her sticker challenge. And our forest of trees is coming along nicely. So five and six going in. And this one is 100. So we have 25, 27, 29, 31, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39. $39 out of 100, so we are working our way. And then we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten dollars left to go in this last one. So this is from Plan to Plan Sticker Co. on Etsy. And it's basically, like I said, a 25 envelope challenge. You have one to 25. We're gonna do the 10. And that's why I like saving this one to last because I could just basically use whatever money I have left. So that is good. And look how fast a hundred bucks you guys goes, you guys. I was thinking, oh, I might have extra money to come back and do more. Yeah, no. <laughs> All right, so let's put in the $10. All right, and so far in here we have 20. 35, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 59, and it's like 325, I think, when it's done, so quite a long way to go, but that is okay. All right, you guys, that is it. The, this binder is getting pretty chunky, so I do need to do a condensing. But thank you so much for joining me. Once again, thank you so much for all of your support. As I said, this stuffing would not be possible without you, especially uh, my members. Special shout out to you guys because your support is basically the reason I got a YouTube check. Without that, um, I would not be getting a check every month. So just a humongous thank you from the bottom of my heart. I love you all so, so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.